The family of a woman killed by a serial dangerous driver says it's disgusted with the justice system. Joshua Bonjour was today sentenced to just a year in jail over a second horror crash while he was on parole. A new day of anguish for the Worthington family feeling betrayed by the justice system. Disgusting. Just absolutely disgusted. Their angry serial road menace, Josh Bonjour, who killed their daughter in 2012, almost did it again, but was only sentenced to 12 months jail. We were worried in the first place. We are worried it's, still. It's certain. He's going to come out. He's going to drive. Charges weren't laid and there was a lot of charges that he should have been charged with. Just, yeah, just, just disgusted. That's all I've got to say. Bonjour wrapped his ute around a pole on the Row Highway in Canning Vale in September. His passenger, Lily Davis, was seriously injured, but he fled the scene, leaving her for dead. Not one iota for anybody. Nobody, not for us, not for this new girl. Nobody. 18-year-old Jodie Worthington was a passenger on Bonjour's quad bike when she was killed. He was on parole for that crash when he drove dangerously again. It's been charged so many times with driving offences, it has no effect. He'll just keep doing it. The magistrate today saying Bonjour had a callous disregard for the safety of the community and his passengers. Bonjour's partner and their six-year-old son, not enough to stop his appalling driving. Bonjour was handed a 12-month jail sentence, but given the crash happened while he was on parole, he won't be released until the year 2020. The magistrate suspended his licence for 30 months, but he will be back behind the wheel and on our roads again. They've banned him in the past it's, and he, he uses it a little so weapon. many times here. Jacqueline Robson, Nine News.